I was uh, there at the clergy were asked to show up to be able to um, be there to be a moral witness just to check out the protest, see how things were going. Um, I showed up, was there for about an hour, things were fine. Um, I went home and then I received a, a, an emergency text asking for clergy to um, come back out again because things had escalated and um, I went out there, rushed out there immediately and uh, when I got there I saw the helicopter and the um, police and riot gear and the police line and um, one of the things that we do as clergy is that we just show up to be able to create space between protesters and the police to try to help de-escalate situations and so uh, on Folsom Boulevard there was a, a line of police officers that had come down and then on the other side police officers had come down Folsom Boulevard the other way and then it, they um, horses had come and they had come from another direction and Again, we're just trying to help keep calm, uh, just to try to um, keep the peace. And then um, we were trying to disperse, but as clergy, we were not going to leave people um, who were still emotional. And so we were escorting them down the road. And then as we were trying to disperse to go down these side roads, there were police that were lined up, so we couldn't go down side streets. And then they came in behind us. And then as we tried to cross over the overpass, uh, police officers immediately suddenly like came out with their bikes, so, blocked you know, us there, and then they came out from behind, you know, I've been this bitch. and suddenly we were all getting arrested, which we had not anticipated. It was said. something like out of a movie, there was a helicopter overhead, our shadows were all over the ground, the clergy were lined up in the front, our hands were up, um, and um, we were just trying to help people to remain calm, and um, not resist arrest, and we were trying to keep this peaceful and non-violent um, at all costs. Yeah. And so, and a year ago, um, only five people were arrested. So suddenly, to have 84 people arrested last night, or however many, um, it, it was sort of confusing and disconcerting. Um, and I think it was um, overdone. And um, it's unfortunate that um, we were trying to disperse, and I think it could have been handled much differently. But the narrative is showing a, a different story that I think that Sacramento really wants to have. Um, that uh, it, we want to be a city that's known as unity and um, trying to come together rather than uh, dividing. And um, But that's where we're at. So we're just trying to, uh, as clergy, just trying to be bridge builders and peacekeepers and um, to do our best to help see the humanity in everyone. Thank you so much for coming with you. Pamela Anderson. Thank you.